Hello, I'm Pastor G. And I'm Pastor T. This is God's Artwork on the Earth presenting to you Crowned Baby Jesus and the Lamb of God, as it is written in Luke ten sixteen. The one who hears you hears me, and the one who rejects you rejects me, and the one who rejects me rejects him who sent me. This ministry is scriptural. Psalm eighty five eleven. Truth shall spring out of the earth, and righteousness shall look down from heaven. Acts 2.19 I will show wonders in heaven above, and signs in the earth beneath, blood and fire and vapor of smoke. Psalm 95, 1-5 O come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us shout joyfully to the rock of our salvation. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving. Let us shout joyfully to him with psalms. For the Lord is the great God, and the great King above all gods. In his hand are the deep places of the earth, the heights of the hills are also his. The sea is his, for he made it, and his hands formed the dry land. Crown baby Jesus and the Lamb of God. This is an awesome, awesome picture. When we uh, when we first found it, to see how beautiful baby Jesus was, and and this is put on the earth by God, the Lamb, the sacrificial Lamb, beside him, and Jesus with his golden crown, which which we're going to look at a little bit more in detail here in a bit. Just an awesome, beautiful artistic rendition from God. Yeah, it tells such a beautiful story. It does. Hallelujah. Thank you, baby Jesus. Crowned baby Jesus and the Lamb of God in Scripture. Matthew 1, 18-25, The Birth of Jesus Christ. Now the birth of Jesus Christ took place in this way. When his mother Mary had been betrothed by, to Joseph, before they came together, she was found to be with child from the Holy Spirit. And her husband Joseph, being a just man and unwilling to put her to shame, resolved to divorce her quietly. But as he considered these things, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream, saying, Joseph, son of David, do not fear to take Mary as your wife. For that which is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will bear a son, and you shall call him his name Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had spoken by the prophet. Behold, the virgin shall conceive and bear a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which means God with us. Crowned Baby Jesus and the Lamb of God in Scripture, John three sixteen to 18 For God so loved the world. For God so loved the world that he gave his only Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish but have eternal life. For God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but in order that the world might be saved through him. Whoever believes in him is not condemned, but whoever does not believe is condemned already, because he has not believed in the name of the only Son of God. Crown baby Jesus and the Lamb of God in Scripture, Isaiah 9, 6 through 7. For to us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the increase of his government and of peace there will be no end. On the throne of David and over his kingdom, to establish it and to uphold it, with justice and with righteousness, from this time forth and forevermore, the zeal of the Lord of hosts will do this. John one twenty nine. Behold the Lamb of God. The next day he saw Jesus coming toward him and said, Behold! the Lamb of God, who takes away the sin of the world. Revelation 12:11. And they have conquered him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony, 
for they loved not their lives even unto death. Revelation 17:14. They will make war on the Lamb, and the Lamb will conquer them. For he is Lord of lords and King of kings, and those with him are called and chosen and faithful. You know, these outline images that, that were given, these need to be studied um, just like the word. The word is confirmed by the picture and the picture is confirmed by the word. This is God's confirmation that his word is truth. He's drawn the Bible out on the earth. He's giving us a, a, a secondary truth to his word. It confirms the word of God with the, the beautiful artistry that, that God can do. Um, you know, when, when you study, when you look to the left, lower left of this picture, you can see baby Jesus. And there on the right, you can see the Lamb of God. And up above baby Jesus' head is a golden crown. And we're going to um, enhance these images a little bit so you can see them clearer. But to study God's artwork is studying his word. And I can tell you, there's some images that we've seen that just will absolutely bring you to tears with joy. Yeah, I was just going to say that. It really does. <clears throat> it's so touching. To know that God loves us so much, to give us so many images, biblical images, uh, over 3,000 so far, confirming stories in 55 books of the Bible so far. That's huge. Mm-hmm. You know, that's over three quarters of the Bible confirmed. And it's just absolutely awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. You know, in Isaiah 25, <clears throat> the Holy Spirit um, says this is a, a future happening. Talking about Jesus. He will swallow up death forever. And the Lord God will wipe away tears from all faces. And the reproach of his people he will take away from all the earth. For the Lord has spoken. You know, <clears throat> looking at baby Jesus' throat in the right hand picture with the small circle. And then following the line over into the big circle is a man on the cross. Mm -hmm. Swallowing up death. Yeah, forever. Forever. A one-time thing. Yeah. And and this wiping away all the tears, we've found that picture also, and it's absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. God's thumb wiping the tear away from the man and Jesus giving us our new bodies. Boy, he sounds like a good God, doesn't he? Yeah, he's an absolutely good God. I love how it uses the word swallow. Yeah. And then it's here on baby Jesus's throat. Yep. I mean, that's so awesome. He, he, he was born king of kings, lord of lords. That's mm -hmm. why he's wearing a golden crown. Yeah. And just as it says in Isaiah 25, he will swallow up death forever. Man on the cross in his throat. Yeah. He is swallowing up death. He swallowed up death on the cross. And it has happened. Yes. 2,000 years ago, so we could live. Yeah. And God gives us a picture confirming that his word is truth. So awesome. Love it. Here's a, kind of an enhanced photo. It's a cutout of the original uh, image from Google Earth uh, to kind of represent baby Jesus. Um, if you can see on the left part of this in the lower baby Jesus's face and then on the right the Lamb of God and then up above to the left is the golden crown that sits on baby Jesus's head um, just so awesome to see this mm -hmm. I mean it is so beautiful um, you know and, and Trina and I we we've had the opportunity to study these images for uh, almost three years now and you know, the, the time consumed, um, the research in finding the scriptures to match up with the pictures, 
uh, I'll tell you what, talking about intimacy with God. Oh, yeah. This is intimacy with God. Mm -hmm. Because you get to you get to read the word that's written down and then you get to look at a picture. Yeah. A satellite image that confirms what you're reading. What a blessing. Yeah. What an added blessing to the written word. And like it reads in in Psalms uh, that we read earlier, mm -hmm. true shall spring out of the earth. Mm -hmm. We're living and, on earth. And the righteous shall look down upon it. You know, we're the righteous. We're looking at what God wrote about, mm -hmm. what, 3,000 years ago. We're reading and we're looking at what King David wrote. Yeah. In today's modern world. And it's just absolutely awesome. Absolutely awesome. You know, by now you've gotten a chance to see this image a couple of times over. And just like with fine art, you know, you have to study it. This picture is absolutely no different than the Word of God. If you don't study it, you're not going to get it. If you glance over it, you're not going to get the meaning. Glory to God for baby Jesus and the Lamb of God. He is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. It's just absolutely awesome to see a golden crown sitting on top of Jesus' head as a baby, swallowing up death, and he is the Lamb of God. The Lamb of God. Mm-hmm. And it's so awesome, so absolutely awesome to know that God loves us this much to give us this precious gift. Um, you know, and, and we're sharing the locations, we're sharing the, the satellite uh, image date, we're sharing so you can go look for yourself. Um, you know, we're working with uh, some of the people at Digital Globe. And the the words that they have to tell us in reply to some of these images is just awesome. You know, uh, just absolutely yep. awesome. They're seeing them too. Yep, they're seeing the images. They're confirming that the images are, are real, that they're not doctored. They are their actual photographs that their satellite uh, units took. And, and, you know, this is God pouring out his spirit on the world. Mm -hmm. On all of mankind. Such a unique way. Yes. It's so precious. You know, that way nobody can argue yeah. about baby Jesus and the lamb. Mm -hmm. Here's the scripture. Here's a picture. You cannot deny it. Putting various scriptures together for one of these drawings. I mean, scripture confirms scripture. Yeah, you have well, to... You have we, to search it out. Yeah, we, we confirmed scripture out of what? Four books on, on this one? Four or five books? Yeah. And, and it's just amazing how, how God uses that to confirm his word. He stretched out the dry lands. He formed it. Mm -hmm. And he can make it anything that he wants. He can put on there. And, and this is just one more confirmation of the truth in Christ Jesus. Yeah, the earth belongs to him. Yes. King of kings and Lord of lords. Amen. Hallelujah. Help us give glory to Father God and keep his beautiful artwork free to the world. In Jesus' name, amen. Here is how you can help. Send your check or money order to Gary or Trina Davis, Box 94, Warman, SK Canada, S0K4S0. Or you can visit our PayPal site and use your credit or debit card at www.paypal.me slash God's Art Ministries. Be sure to look for our ministry logo. You know, what we're doing here is very, very time consuming. Um, making these videos generally takes about a half a day to a full day, depending on the actual image and the amount of scripture that it reflects on. And this is something that God is trying to give as a precious gift, a heavenly gift to his children. These are one of the secrets that God is giving to his children and to the world.
the Jews and the Gentiles. You know, we, we have Jewish friends that, that have seen some of these images, and it has absolutely changed their life. One of my best friends out in Arizona has, has gone from a Torah Jew to a Christian. He gave his life to Jesus Christ through these images. And that's the same way the Bible does. Scripture reveals God's love, reveals the truth. And these images that God has put on the earth that he laid out for us. It's just awesome how these images work on you. And this is just one of more than a hundred videos that we've done so far. And we've been working on this now for about three years. And I just give all the glory and all the praise to the Lord God for what he's doing in this ministry to touch millions of people. Please share these videos. Share our information. Help us to help the world understand God's love for his children. This is an awesome, awesome representation of how God built the foundation of Christianity. He, he is our salvation. And if we build on anything other than that, it's built in the sand and it's going to be destroyed. When it goes through the fire, it's going to be destroyed. But if we're building on the foundation of Christ that he laid, it will make it through the fire. And we will receive our reward. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Here's how you can reach us and interact with us, which we absolutely enjoy doing. Thank you so much. Yes. Go to our Facebook account. It's called God's Art and Word. That's facebook.com forward slash God's Art and Word. There you're, you're going to read devotionals. We have books uploaded. We have uh, some of the many, many images already posted that have been uh, uh, put into a photographic uh, detailed image to where you can see it better, to where you can study the still images. Um, go to our YouTube channel. It's God's Art. Please look for our logo here beside. Uh, if you want to email us, you're welcome to. Hate mail is just absolutely going to go in the trash immediately. We don't need any hate mail. Um, this is all about showing God's love in his creation. It's all about showing his love in what he has done in this world. The love that he gave us through Christ Jesus. And, and we just absolutely will not accept any hate mail. It'll go straight in the trash. We won't even bother responding. Uh, if you want to subscribe, you can uh, contact us at subscribe at godsartministries.com and, and we'll uh, get you put on the list for all of our updates. Uh, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you for supporting this ministry. We thank you for sharing God's love in these videos with your friends and family and coworkers. It's just absolutely awesome the things that God has given to those who love him. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes. He loves us so much. And this is a very precious gift. 3,000 images to date. 55 books. Stories from 55 books of the Bible confirmed through Old, satellite image. Yeah. Old Covenant. New Covenant. Yeah. From Adam and Eve to the coming king. Yeah. You know, God left absolutely nothing out. And, you know, it takes a lot of time and energy to, to do these things and to put them together. And we just thank you for being a part of it. We thank you for supporting this ministry with any size gift you can give um, to help this coming along and, and to glorify God, to give praise and glory to Jesus Christ and to absolutely show people the love through the Holy Spirit. What a blessing to Israel. What a blessing to the nations. What a blessing to the church of God. Yeah. To the, to the lambs and the sheep of God. It is just absolutely awesome. This is another way you can show people that don't believe in God 
Hey, if you don't believe the story of Isaac, Jacob, and Esau, let me show you a video. Mm -hmm. You know, if you don't believe that Jesus has already come, that he is the three-day builder, let me show you a video. If you don't believe the story of Adam and Eve, let me show you a video. Mm -hmm. That's what this does. It confirms the scripture. It confirms the truth of God. Christ Jesus through the Holy Spirit. We won't put it up if there's no scripture with no. it. No. And, and you know, the, the, the cool thing about this is not only does he confirm his word, but he's giving us more modern day stuff as well to confirm what has happened in the past, what's going on right now. And it's just absolutely awesome. It's absolutely awesome. God knows the beginning to the end. Mm -hmm. And That's he's right. put it all on the earth for us to see. Absolutely amazing. Thank you, Lord Jesus.